Does the source of income define the tenant? According to Elliot 5220 here, people are people and the source of their income does not define them. Let's discuss. All right, y'all, welcome to the show. Show where we talk about stuff you ask me or stuff you should be asking me. And it's all related to real estate investing, Section 8, because that is what I do, okay? I am a Section 8 investor, consultant, broker, landlord, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. Section 8, man, I eat, live, breathe, sleep that stuff, okay? And we got this cat, Elliot5220. He was commenting on one of our videos discussing Section 8, talking about them, and he uh, was offended, Okay, he was offended by some of my comments, and uh, the main point here is he's saying, you know, I was basically saying something to the effect of like, you know, your Section 8 tenants are going to pose like this level of risk versus like a, you know, a differing tenant, a non-Section 8 tenant, and he got offended by that. He said, that's discrimination. People are people, and the source of their income does not define them, Okay. People are people. The source of their income does not define them. And, you know, I have a question for Elliot. Elliot, brother, are you fucking retarded? Okay, that is my question. Now, some people might get offended, and I'm offended too, right? Some people get offended when you call someone retarded. Apparently, in 2024, you're now, you're no longer supposed to call people retarded. But you know what? I think that's wrong, and it offends me, because I think people like Elliot should be called retarded way more. If people would explain to Elliot how freaking retarded he actually is, he might not say something this goddamn retarded. You know what I'm saying? This guy says, people are people, the source of their income doesn't define them. Bro, are you retarded? Seriously. Honest question. Are, like, do you have a helmet? Like, do you have to, are you drooling right now? Like, that is the dumbest thing ever, okay? Do I believe that anybody could do anything? Yeah, okay, but there, <laughs> there are things that we can do uh, to kind of project out, like, the frequency of how behavior happens, right? Like, if you come to me and you say, hey, man, you shouldn't discriminate against a tenant because he's black versus he's white versus he's Hispanic. Sure, that's cool. I'm good with that. We're on the same page, right? If I got a black dude here, a white dude here, and a Hispanic dude here, the mere fact that this dude is brown, this dude is white, and this dude is black is not going to be any, like, effective way for me to screen them as my tenant. I need to look at things that are actually going to have direct results uh, on my business. And then I look into things, you know, such as criminal history, job history, credit score, things of that nature, source of income, level of responsibility. These are all things that, that do actually matter, right? In and of itself, being on Section 8 shows me that you are more irresponsible than someone who is not on Section 8. Just being on Section 8 in and of itself, folks, shows me that you are not responsible enough, not financially stable enough to pay for the roof over your own head. Literally, being on Section 8 shows us that, okay? Does that mean I don't rent to Section 8 tenants? No. I Literally, that's my business is Section 8 investing. But if you're going to be in a business, you better understand how that business works and what your customer base is and things of that nature. And if you think being on Section 8 tenant is like being on Section 8 is like an irrelevant detail for your tenant, such as like the color of their skin, the color of their hair, uh, what they look like, you're an idiot. You are literally an idiot. That's like me saying like, oh, let's buy this house, but before I buy this house, let me check the sex offender registry. I got kids. I don't want to live next to any kid diddlers, right? And then I check, and I'm like, oh, this house has four kid diddlers within like two streets of it. 
I don't want to live there because I don't want my kids living next to kid diddlers because I feel like that would increase their risk of getting diddled because there's a bunch of kid diddlers there. And then that'd be like Elliot being like, Duh! What are you doing? People are people. Their sex offender status does not define them. Anybody can diddle a kid. Well, that's true, Elliot. Anybody does have the ability to diddle or not diddle a kid. However, when you're not fucking retarded, you will look at that scenario and go, you know what? These dudes have already diddled a fucking kid, so the frequency and the risk level of which they will diddle again is obviously higher than for people who have not been arrested and prosecuted and charged for said crime, you fucking retard, right? And that goes to other things too, tying it back to real estate. It's like evictions. Yes, when you rent your property to a tenant, folks, there is a risk. It is never zero. There is always a risk that that tenant will need to be evicted by you. However, if you're intelligent, you look at past behavior, people show you their, uh, you know, uh, th their proclivity to doing something. If they've already been evicted, they pose a higher level of having to be evicted again in, as opposed to someone who's never been evicted, okay? The same thing, guys. People are showing you this. Yes, there are always outliers, but folks... Your Section 8 tenants have a higher likelihood of being irresponsible because they're showing you they are irresponsible by the fact that they are not responsible enough to pay for their rent. Your tenants who've already been evicted are showing you they have a propensity to not pay their rent and need to be evicted. Kid diddlers have a propensity to diddle kids. You get what I'm saying, guys? So, like, can we stop with like this woke nonsense, like Elliot. I just wanna end the video by saying, fuck you. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to Holton Wise TV for more financial information, education, and entertainment.